Hello, one and all, and welcome to me playing... Oh, I figured the guitar would <laughs> halt for a bit longer than just one or two seconds. I figured it was a good time to start talking. Um, hello, and welcome to me playing Brutal Legend, quite possibly the best idea I've ever had. Uh, I've actually beaten this game before, you know, but at release, almost a decade ago. <laughs> And, uh, actually, I think I know what this song is. Is this Testament? It, it's Testament. Yeah. One of the very first videos that... Yeah, it's Testament. bam pick a bam pick a bam pick a bam bam Uh, on my old channel, Hammock Shreds. Uh, my most popular video, in fact, uh, was... Uh, I, I can't talk and do this at the same time for some reason. Okay. Anyway, I should also mention, uh, <laughs> copyright holders, please don't <laughs> take down my video. Um, I'm sure, I'm sure you're, you guys are wonderful over there, the guys who make the testament happen, but please, have some mercy on me. Um, the very first video of mine that really caught on, I was trying to say, was a video of me just uploading the song you hear in the intro cutscene. Uh, Girlfriend by Cabbage Boy. <laughs> And at this point, I think it's garnered, like, over 100,000 views. The only video of mine that's ever caught on like that. <laughs> uh, I guess normal. I may or may not have to turn the V-Sync back on, depending on how the V-Sync in, in this game is. We shall see. <laughs> Watch it! Dude, check it! Oh. Hey, Riggs, uh, sorry I smashed your guitar last night. <laughs> what the? It's like new. Well, how'd you do that? Yeah, I'll try not to smash it so much this time. Don't mess with that guy. He scares me. <laughs> hey, Eddie, man. I hate to ask, but our manager wanted to know. When are you gonna build us, like, a new set? Hey, it's Philemon this from Persona. Stonehenge stuff was funny in a kind of ironic retro sort of way, but... Look, Eddie, don't get me wrong. You're the best, okay? The greatest roadie in the biz. Everybody knows you can fix anything, build anything. Well, so maybe you could build us something that would speak more to our tween demographic. Is all I'm saying. Sooner or later, you're gonna have to join the modern world, you know? All right! Do you people want to hear some heavy metal? No! <laughs> oh, yeah. In a kind of ironic way, it brings back memories! <laughs> Be my best friend! I can fix anything. Except that. Metal is dead. So fine, oh my! Skin it like a porcupine! Say what? <laughs> you ever feel like you were born in the wrong time? Like you should have been born earlier? When the music was... real? Like the 70s? Earlier. Like the early 70s. <laughs> uh oh. I told you not to climb on that, you stupid mother! From time to time, Brutal Legend may need to utilize strong language in order to accurately portray the authentic road experience to the player. I want to hear every nasty syllable. Fucking. Piece of shit! You can't it. Please let him fall. Damn it! They put so much effort into this game, I swear to gosh. Good roadie knows his whole job is to make someone else look good. That's a shame. Keep someone else safe. That it, I, I think, someone else do failed? I think, it, it, at least back in the day it did. A good roadie stays out of the spotlight. Back when it mattered. The failure. 
not. <laughs> or rather, to succeed or not. If he's doing his job right, you don't even know he's there. Once in a while, he might step on stage just to fix a problem, to set something right. But then before you even realize he was there, or what he did, he's gone. contains some blood and gore, including dismemberment and occasional beheadings, whenever it is necessary for the plot, historical accuracy, or to look awesome. Okay, but only when it would look really awesome. Yes. <laughs> it's funny, I don't remember that. I must have not picked the gore option. <laughs> All part of the concert. Be gone, other worldly heathens, and make way for the new metal world. Has finally come for us to serve our master. Uh, hey. <laughs> hey, I'm not your master. No, you are not. <gasps> Black Sabbath! Oh my god, this video is gonna get flagged to hell. <laughs> oh, uh. But, uh, oh, uh, yeah, the game's starting I, already? Uh, I totally know the master. We're really good friends. My weapon of choice. We've known each other since. Oh, couldn't see over my Dr. Pepper. The separator. Touch not this awesome axe or suffer the wrath of the tainted coil. Axe attack. Or hold it, if you want. God, yes. Now, as many will attest to, if only uh -oh. I just tune that thing. That if only the game had stuck to being a beat 'em up. Am I right? Wait, can I pick this up too? Clementine, a humble guitar back home. But here, the power of her rock seems to be amplified by the world itself. Shocker or Pyro? Either one is nice. Yes! Taste that! That's a rock! <laughs> well, defend thine self, holding down B will block many of your enemies' attacks. It will also back out of menus. 
Well, I tried. Earth Shaker, press A and X. This power core will blow everybody away and bring down the house. Am I going to get a chance to use it on anybody? <laughs> I've killed. Oh, there we go. Bringing down the house. But then again, me personally, I don't remember thinking that the RTS combat was that bad. Then again, I was much younger ten years ago. <laughs> much, much younger and much more naive. I am still rather naive, but less so. Oh wait, that's the block button. Never mind. Oh. How many more of these Earth Shakers do I have to do? Oh, it's for the purpose of the plot. I get it. Oh, okay. And then I finish these guys off, and then no worries. Smooth sailing. No, no, no. You're getting the shocker until you're gone. There you are. So maybe the game has, in a way, like, reversed aged, where it's gotten better with time. Who knows? But so far, immediately, I was taken aback by just like, wow, it's rare that you see games this enthusiastically, like, video gamey and into their All right, nice concepts. Try, lady, or whatever you are. And the facial I'm animation. I think you're a nun, but I know you're really some kind of big, ugly demon, so let's have it. Aha! I knew it! Big, ugly demon. <laughs> Kind of sexy, though, in a weird way. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> blah, 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 blah. Oh, I can do that? Uh, whoop. Am I blocking? I don't think I was blocking. Well, I'll have to turn me press B and L to die. Okay, cool. I think I heard once that killing nuns is bad luck. I'd better get out of here. Ah, oh, come on! Come on! I'm better than this! I just killed a big ugly demon, I'm better than this! See, there you go. Ah, oh, come on! La ba la la la! I get on the big ugly demon mobile? Nice! Okay. Well, here goes. Um, oh man, gotta get this thing moving. Let's see here. Dear evil, messed up demon powers of darkness. <laughs> uh, and unimaginable evil. Again, Please it's rare that you see games awesome corpse pile quite like this. But a visitor in your strange world, which some would call hellish, but I have to admit, it's kind of badass. Oh, lords of gross leather things and S and M type wear. You know, you guys really have style. That battle nun. <laughs> she was hot. Uh, <laughs> sorry about killing her. Uh, but you're evil, though, right? So by your good graces... Uh -oh. uh, I meant evil! Evil graces! Ah, son of a... Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. <laughs> Clearly, I'm dead. <laughs> oh, nice cheater move, guys. Really cool. I hope nobody here is susceptible to seizures. Uh, Earthshaker! There he go! Uh, what? Oh man, don't tell me I've been slaying hot girls this whole time. The axe. So you come for it as well. No, but these guys jumped me and... Hang on. 
And it was just sitting there, so... You handle it very naturally. Yeah, that's kind of strange, isn't it? I've never touched an axe before. Who are you? Uh, right shoulder. We've got to get out of here before he arrives. Yeah. Double team approach. Any ally impressed Why? to team up. Join forces with your allies for more powerful double team attacks. Wait, before who arrives? Emperor Deviculus. Who? Emperor Deviculus, where are you from? It's kind of hard to say. Um, I kind of live on the road. Be assured, you don't want to be here when he arrives. What's the big deal? You're slaughtering his personal guard for one thing. Oh, aha. So, where's my double team? Double team, double team. Double team? Double team. Hey girl, let's double team. Oh, come on! I'm giving it my all here. Double team. Uh, it's not working! Why? There we go! Finally works. Come on, we have to run. Whee! Oh, I could have used it right here. Okay. Do it again. Careful. Yeah! Insta kill. Ah, no collectibles. No coins, no loot. At least not yet. Uh, gosh darn. Grand Slam. A, X, A. Pop up your enemies and knock them into the into the bleachers of infinite pain. Uh, A, X, A. Uh, A, X, A. There we are. Batter up. Oh, I had to actually look at them, maybe? I don't, that, maybe that was my problem? I doubt it. It Follow might just me. be kind of clunky. Okay. This way. We but have that to get looks to the interesting. The... Hold on, hold on, hold on. This looks wait. interesting. Take a look outside. Whoa. Hey, come here and check out this cool stuff. Over here, you... Oh, yeah, right. Hey, I'll be right there. Over here. Whoa. Hey, come here and check out this cool stuff. Over here, you... Oh, yeah, over here, right. You... I'll be right there. Ah. Is that all that did? Just like a dialogue exchange. All right. Hey, over here. Yeah, that's a lot of dudes. Uh, you okay, my lady? Okay, what is she's this okay. Place? The Temple of Ormagodon. It's a place of ancient power, but no one knows its true purpose. Its purpose is probably power. <laughs> Now, can we look at the cool stuff? Relic Razor. A rare vine grows wherever the land is steeped in legend. Play the solo nearby and uh, to unearth ancient structures and monuments. Hold right trigger and select the Relic Razor solo from the main menu. Wowie. Now, oh, oh vehicles. Beauty by simply rocking, that's all. Is that helping us get out of here alive? Actually, yeah, I think so. You got the wheels and other stuff. Got everything we need to make a hot rod vehicle. Minecart? I call it the Druid Plow. Let me show you how it works. What you do, you slam it into goo hoo hoo hello. Looks like it's working already. You have awakened the spirit of the beast himself. I hope so. <laughs> Am I gonna ram it myself? Not just in the cutscene, but me. Let's fucking ram it. 
Ah, the Deuce, aka the Druid Plow. A temple on wheels, this gift from the Titans can only be assembled by the worthy. Hit the gas! Breaks in reverse. Ah! This is much better. Motorhead! Ding a ling, ding a ling, ding a ling, ding a ling, ding a ling. the feeding area gates. Feeding area? What are they feeding? Oh gosh. Enough, you might not need to find out. I hope I don't have to fight that anytime soon. Um, what's up with Crazy Legs? They've called in reinforcements. Why such a large force? What? Maybe because we're badasses. Also, why suddenly well, Apocalypse? Name has something against you. Okay, I haven't mentioned it yet, but this place is nuts. <laughs> yes, these are dark times for our land, but there are a few of us fighting to change the way things are. Is that why you don't come? do it. To join us and fight for the liberation of humanity? You know, I don't really know. I haven't really thought about it yet, but uh, so far that's the best explanation I've heard. Ooh, boss fight? This is very explicitly boss fight room. Oh, come on! I'm fucking sick of you guys! <laughs> Alright, while I'm slaying these dudes, you get that gate open, okay? God, she's awesome. <laughs> Do I have to? I don't have to! Fuck you, video game. I don't have to. But in all reality, I probably actually have to. Uh, or maybe there's something very specific I have to do here before. <laughs> Done? What'd I do? What special thing did I do? Okay. Oh, uh, sorry. Did you know those dudes? Okay. Nitro! Press the L stick to summon extra Nitro. Sacrifice some control for an explosive burst of speed. I somehow vividly remember this boss fight. Oh, ah, it's not helping! Oh, supposed to help me with that. Okay, handbrake. Hold B while steering. Okay, I'm gonna stop reading this. <laughs> Self-explanatory. Like that, Miss Licky? Okay, I like that. That's pretty time. cool. Oh, here she goes again. Whoa, 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 whoa! Gosh darn damn, I guess I, I guess I didn't succeed with that one. <laughs> I do love me some unique boss mechanics, a la Legend of Zelda. Uh, not again. And Ebuski. <laughs> I can't believe you fell for that twice. I should have got them all, but video game physics. Heads up. And just like that, we're done. Okay. Or just phase two. <laughs> You'll never French kiss again. What's French kissing? Uh, it's, uh... The, um, gate's open. What? Oh. The gate. Nah, my man, it's never that easy. You gotta wait at least a few hours for <laughs> something like that happens. What's that? I couldn't hear you. It's like you got a lisp or something. <laughs> Over here, you... Foul and rotten worm. Come and fight so that I may sweat my blade on your hey, knock that off. entrails. Uh, oh, no, uh, I, I wasn't sure what to do. Uh, What's the matter? Are you blind? Uh, Earthshaker? I appreciate the many 
Oh man, I cut there. I cut out the devastation he bit. Dead. I'm sorry about that. And you, I will now teach you. A... Hang on. I shall now teach you of French kissing. I was trying to say that I appreciate the many uses of the Earthshaker. This is where we run. This has already happened to me once in the past, like, half an hour. Okay. Come, come, my lady. Come, come, my lady. Oh, right. Nitrous. Uh, nitro. There we go. Um. Okay. <laughs> Uh, think fast. Okay, cool. I say again, why is everything so apocalypsy? <laughs> they try and squeeze in so much dialogue. You like the car? Yeah. I can't wait to show it to Lars. Ridiculous. They say it was the fire beast Omogodon himself? No. Far, far worse than me. It was Sakoria. I can smell her blood. The season of pain is upon us. But why has she returned now? What does she want? War. Finally. We should keep moving. We'll be safe in Bladehenge. Here, take this map. Kashwoop. Dibba dibboo. I guess we'll arrive there and that'll be, a good, that'll be a good place to stop, probably. What's in Bladehenge? Vroom vroom. Bladehenge is the center of the human resistance movement. Get to Rob Halford's settlement. Yes! Well, right now, probably Rob Arnie Halford. Is just Lars, his sister. Into the light, into the light. Bam, bam, breaking the law, breaking the law. Lars is a great leader, truly inspirational. But we've had a few practical setbacks. An army needs food, shelter, transportation. So many details to manage. Sounds like what you need is a roadie. Avoid a the roadie. local rile uh, uh, wildlife. It's a long story. How about when we get to town, we have a big powwow with your whole nope, army. Nope, nope. We'll have a campfire, and I'll tell you all no, about it. Look out, look out, look out, look out. Over a big flagon of mead. What's a flagon of mead? It's a drink. Aren't we in medieval times? I, uh... Close enough, I guess. Beer, but you can have as many kegs as you want. To Bladehenge! <laughs> I figured I was going the right way. Ophelia, what demon have you allowed to follow you home this time? Uh. Oh, hello. Those tires are like $3,000 each. She's Lars's little sister. A little high strung. Am I right or am I right? No, it's not who I expected it to be. So let me get this straight. These performers, they don't even have to tune their own instruments? Nah, that's our job. Looks like a the member roadies. of Rat. The rock star's job is just to deliver the audience to the promised land of rock. Fascinating. Um, can we get back to the part where you were summoned here from another world? Oh yeah, by this little guy here. 
You were brought here by Orma Godin? The eternal fire beast? The cremator of the sky. Destroyer of the ancient world. Yeah, I accidentally Big guy who breathes fire. In mouth and it totally went nuts on me. There are those who speak of a day when Orma Godin the Fire Beast shall bring a warrior into this world. To destroy us. To deliver us. There is some dispute about the translation. But having met you, I can tell that you are here to help us. To lead us. To wage war against the demons. To liberate humanity. Hell yeah! I mean, hold on a second. I don't know anything about waging war. But, uh, I'll tell you what I do know. I know from meeting you, Lars, that you are the true leader here, not me. What Pardon I know me. is how to put a crew together and how to keep it organized and how to take it on the road. That, my friend, is exactly what we need. But I'm sure you must be longing to return to your homeland. <laughs> All right. So where's your army, Lars? We have none. General Lion White has taken away most of our young Lion men White. to toil in his mines. And he's taken our women to serve as slaves in his decadent pleasure tower. Well, let's go get him back. Sounds supremely interesting. No, you are not to go near Lion White again. You were almost impaled last time. Compromise. We'll get the dudes first, and then they can help us get the ladies. But time to break the chains of love. I'll show you the mines, but I think you'll find these chains very hard to break. Go to the mines. World. Tamp slabs. These artifacts seem to have been deliberately left behind to document rifts and power cores that can be played in the book. Okay, cool. Okay. So can I save it here? Stop it. Save and quit. Oh. Just right and left. Yes. Okay. Well, that was the first session. Brutal Legend. I'm already having an amazingly fun time. Uh. I hope. Uh. Whoever's watched this first part will continue to join me on this adventure. Oh, wait. Is this Metallica? Am I right? No, wait, no, this is this is Electric Eye. I'm stupid, by Judas Priest. Wham, 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 wham. Yep, electric guy. Okay, anyway, <laughs> that's enough doot dootin'. I'll see you guys next time on some more Brutal Legend.